Thank you for joining this lesson. We are still continuing with the capsabet paper, math paper 2, the primoc, whereby we are now going to number 3. It's a question in trigonometry 3, whereby we are told that uh, given that 2 cosine of in brackets to x minus 30 degrees equals to negative 6 out of 5, find x where x ranges between 180 and 360 degrees so the first thing to do here we first of all, first of all divide with the constant such that we have 2x minus 30 degrees equals to negative 6 over 5 negative 6 out of 5 divided by 2 and this gives us negative 0.6 negative 0 0.6 so with negative 0 0.6 now we can get the acute angle os cosine is 0 0.6 so the acute angle os cosine is the shown one the cos inverse of 0 0.6 is uh, 53.13 degrees but now because the cosine is negative, we want this acute angle in the in the quadrants where cosine is negative. So which means we can uh, draw the, the unit circle first together with the four quadrants such that we can say that uh, all then sign here trigonometry here and see there such that because cosines are negative in the second and in the third quadrant then we want this acute angle in those quadrants such that in the second quadrant, 53.13 means 180 minus 53.13. So the first angle will be 126.87 degrees. And the next one, the next one is going to be in the third quadrant. So a 53. 0.13 in the third quadrant is 180 plus 53.13 such that the angle is 233.13 we can proceed with getting more angles whereby now if we go for a complete cycle in the next cycle this angle becomes because we will have add 360 then it is 360 plus 126.87. That gives us 486.87. And the next one will be when we take 233.13, then we add 360. This gives us 593. 593.13. With this, now we can get the exact value of x, whereby now we will say because this one is the cosine of 2x minus 30. Okay, the angle now, 2x minus 30 degrees equals to all these values, 126.87. 233.13 486.87 and finally 593.13 so now we can remain with the 2x equals to we add 30 in each whereby we get 156.87 because negative 30 taken to the other side becomes a positive when we add that here love 263.13 the other one, when we add that here, 
you get 516.87 when we add that to the other one we will get um, 623.13 so now to remain with x we can divide it through by 2 because we have 2x 156 0.87 over 2 which gives us 78.44 the next one will be 263.13 divided by 2 it becomes 131.57 the next one will be 516.87 divided by 2 this will be 258.4 and finally 623.13 divided by 2 becomes 311 311.57 so now the angle should range between 180 and 360 so x will be equal to 258.4 and 311.57 because when you go for another cycle now we will go beyond 360 and it is the upper limit so that is how we get we get the answers or the values of x thank you for following kindly subscribe to this channel and share the link